Hi, my name is Megan, and I had Lyme for two years, about, and um, it was pretty bad for me. It was, um, I had trouble in um, school, just getting up for school in the morning, and um, I went from being a captain of my soccer team to not even starting in games, um, so that was really hard for me. Um, but now I'm feeling a lot better, and um, I'm playing a lot more soccer, and I can make it through the day, and um, it's great. And it's great. Good for you. Um, what was the worst thing that you had, Megan? The symptom that you had? Um, probably fatigue. Like, it was just really hard for me being really active to um, just not be able to do things and having trouble moving and it was just really hard. Did you miss a lot of school too? Um, yeah, I, I did. I would leave early a lot and I'd come in late a lot. Um, yeah, so it was tough making up work and stuff like that. When did you start feel, feeling better? Now you did a program, it was a full 12 weeks, you're almost done, mm -hmm. right? When did you start feeling better? Um, it's probably about a month ago, a month, maybe two months ago. Um, I had just played a tournament and um, I just I felt really good afterwards. And then from there, I just kept going up and up and up. So. All right, here's the, here's the, the big question. Mm -hmm. When you came in, you were pretty bad, right? Mm -hmm. um, if I had to ask you how good you are right now, how good would you say you are? Very good. <laughs> Very good. Uh, and percentage-wise, <laughs> so uh, are you are you fifty percent better? Are you hundred percent, ninety percent? You you what number? You pick a number. Tell me how good you are. Ninety-nine. Ninety-nine. Oh, I love that number. <laughs> All right. Last question. There's a lot of people out there now. You're fourteen years old. Okay. There's a lot of people that have Lyme disease, and they need to know, you know, if there's something out there that works for them. What would you tell somebody else that's 14 years old that went two years with Lyme disease and missed their soccer and their school and everything? What would you tell these people um, if it was your friend or somebody? What would you tell them? Um, it's totally worth it. <laughs> um, it's hard. Get, I live a ways away, so it's hard getting here two times a week and stuff, but it's totally worth it. I'm so glad I've done it. <laughs> Thank you, Megan. You're welcome.